Hello, my name is Andy Allison, and I'm the proud principal of Sweet Apple Elementary School, located just outside of Atlanta, Georgia. For the 2015 and 16 school year, my school was recognized for both greatest gains and highest achievement, ranking number one among all 96 Fulton County schools. This is really something that I'm proud of, as Fulton County is the fourth largest school system in the state of Georgia. I'm honored to share that for our state scoring system, known as the College and Career Readiness Performance Index, all of our subgroups were met at the state performance targets and we experienced typical to high growth. I believe that many things have contributed to this success and I would love the opportunity to share my approach and strategies at the 2017 Model Schools Conference. At Sweet Apple, I've led my team to consistently use, utilize best practices to ensure that all students are successful regardless of socioeconomic status, ethnicity, or disability. During my tenure, the students of Sweet Apple Elementary have truly excelled. Because of my role at the school, success with our students, I believe I'm an excellent choice for Model Schools Conference presenter. I would love this opportunity to share the steps to create a data-driven culture of high expectations, along with a culture that requires students to take greater ownership in learning with other schools. One action which I helped to spearhead and I feel has truly contributed to our ongoing success was our implementation of student-led conferences. Or as we like to call them, SLCs. Mr. Allison, we can take it from here. Last year at Sweet Apple, our, our school took a giant leap in empowering and involving students in our own learning. We dedicated an entire release day to, let, to allow us, the students, for the first time ever, to sit in the driver's seat of the conferences, steering con conversations about our own process in school. Our SLCs definitely did not look like your typical everyday parent-teacher conference. Students took charge of the conversations about their learning. Some even got to sit at the teacher's desk. We shared our goals and showed our parents our work and gave comments on their strengths and weaknesses, developed, developed strategies for improvement, and just as important, had a chance to work on our little communication skills. We were a little nervous at first, but it turned out to be easier and more fun than we thought. And we have to admit, the parents and teachers were quite sure what to expect at their first. Their role at the conference was to ask follow-up questions and actively listen to us, the students. Which, by the way, Mr. Allison, you're doing a great job of that right now. We are excited to say that we will be engaging in student-led conferences again this year. Building, our, building on our great start last year, this year brings the introduction of electronic portfolios for every student, one note for grades 4th and 5th, and Seesaw for kindergarten through 3rd grade. All of our students at Sweet Apple are already using these tools to collect our work samples to share on conference day. Thanks, girls. Please know I would truly look forward to the opportunity to share more with other instructional leaders at the Model Schools Conference in Nashville. I am convinced that I can inspire more principals to build school cultures and implement best practices by increasing the ownership of learning by students. Thank you.